I just spoke to the inspector general and I showed them this evidence and they don't want to talk to me. They do not want to talk to me. That man was a witness and that police officer was a witness to everything that I said down here. All right. That police officer was a witness to this. All right. How you doing, brother? Oh, oh, God. You just. All right. <laughs> he gave me a big. He gave me a big hug. He lo he loved me. All right. That's the that's the sergeant at arms, master at arms. All right. The city inspector said that they can't do nothing about this. This is the when I turned this into the Baltimore City Solicitor, the state's attorney. All right, that's February the 2nd, 2011. I was kidnapped by the state and charged with terrorist activities. I was showing fraud in Baltimore City and Baltimore County courts and mainly here in City Hall. The money that y'all make off of the prison industry locking up black Baltimore. You feel me? Good morning, I said. Like everything I said is right there. That's, there go the cases. And the Inspector General just nonchalantly said that they can't help me. They don't want to help me because they know that it's going to cost the city a lot of money. It's going to cost the city a lot of money. I came to file a class action lawsuit about the treatment of black people in Baltimore, a $2.5 billion class action lawsuit. Y'all is in $3 billion in debt. You can't afford a lawsuit. My paperwork in order, man. That's an interstate compact. I am Dred Scott. Dog, y'all was getting paid off of me in Illinois and Maryland. Like I said, that police officer was a witness, and that man was a witness. We were sitting right here. I'm going to show you how these politics and politicians really work, dog, for real. Information. Yeah, see it back door. That was received in 2012. That was received in 2011. Y'all got s s violations. Y'all the city, dog. Y'all talking about crime and justice? Kai Jackson got this. Mary Mubala got this. You feel me? And y'all wonder why I be shutting y'all down. Dog, like I said, I go to jail for the right reasons. Martin Luther King went to jail. And he's sitting up in there right now, and y'all talking about Martin Luther King. That's where y'all talk about pimping people's shit. How you doing? Talking about pimping people's shit. Dog, like I said, I want my day in court. I was kidnapped by the state of Maryland and Illinois, and fraud was committed by the state. Scott Schellenberger, Greg Bernstein, Marilyn Mosby, Brian Frost, Doug Gansler. Dog, I'm going to holler. Man, I'm going to shut shit down. Like I said, charge me, charge me, lock me up. I go to jail for the right reasons. I go to jail, that means I get a trial. I get a trial. You feel me? And you're going to have to produce this evidence. And you're going to have to produce all the material from these cases. All right, thank you. That's Johnny Oleski. Oh, man, I'm putting this on the steps. That's Johnny Oleski and Chief Hyatt. All right? This is my third letter. This is emails, all right? Civil lawsuit, emails. You see who got that? That's Gene Woloski, all right? Congressman Cummings' office. Diana K. Suggs. You see that? Oh, so it's like on this side? Yeah. 1402 Lockner. I'm a Baltimore City resident. Release all material to the voters. This is your city inspectors protecting y'all's corruption, and y'all wonder why y'all in a hole in which y'all in. Uh, no justice, no peace, and I'm going to keep marching in these streets. You owe me $2.6 million in lost wages. You owe me $130 million in film and, 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 and videos. I'm not walking away from that. It's going to come out of somebody's pocket. You kidnapped me. You robbed me. You called me a terrorist. So I'm going to live up to your expectations. I'm going to terrorize you with the truth. Anytime you see me, dog, I'm going to shut shit down. Mic check. And I'm, loud in, I'm louder than the average bear, boo-boo. Y'all still got events coming on. Y'all got the 2020 session. Somebody going to address this.